Look closer. I'm telling you, the file is trash. The Constant doesn't so much burn his bridges as blow them up. Arthur Edwards, whoever he was, don't exist anymore. His personal data somehow deletes itself from any system that records him, way beyond advanced. The partners spared no expense to make sure their controller would be untraceable. How untraceable? Look, I did what you asked, but Gray's gone and I'm no Diana. I'm not who you need right now. You gotta be kidding me. ICA? I used every encryption known to man. Who are these guys? The best. It's only a matter of time before they get lucky. We need to take them down. <sighs> you and which army? I know where the agency stores its files, mission reports, client data. If we leak it to the public. You want to whistleblow the ICA? It's the path of least resistance. Turns out, you are who I need right now, Olivia. I do this, and I'm out. So, what are we breaking into? Data facility in Chongqing, China. Run by a man called Hush. Of course. The ICA site in Chongqing houses the agency's data storage and analyst division. Needless to say, security is daunting. The state-of-the-art server vault is biometrically wired to the facility's two overseers. Imogen Royce, behavioral analysis pioneer, and Hush, a data security guru with a taste for fringe transhuman experimentation. Tell me about Hush. A former cyber terrorist for the Ministry of State Security in Kedanyang, who fled his country after one of the Po regime's periodic purges. He made a career doing cybersecurity for dark web deplorables, human traffickers, organ harvesters, scum like him, with no code or conscience. ICA sure can pick him. No offense. Can you disable security? A dual authentication protocol ensures that any handling of data must be directly authorized by Hush and Royce. The proverbial human factor device to make the system impenetrable. Luckily, I found a loophole. If both overseers should unexpectedly die within a short space of time, the system reverts to a temporary fail-safe protocol, which I can bypass. Take them off the board, and you'll have free access to the data core, and I'll handle the rest. And you're sure it'll work? Look, I know, Hush. If I'm wrong, we won't live long enough to regret it. All right, I will leave you to prepare. Uh, have you seen a girl around? Uh, short hair with a bright green bag? Sorry. Shit. She says she'd meet me here. She's probably running late. Yeah. She used to be really reliable. When we were at school, she was my rock. She always let me copy her notes. She would never have kept me waiting like that. Sorry, sir. I cannot let you through. I've got my orders.
Am I supposed to focus when the kitchen at the train station? Find your inner zen. Oh! oh man, that was brutal. You can't do that. I need help. Don't have to go. You're lucky that person is still breathing. Anybody? Looking good, man. Looking good. You're gonna regret this!
You can hack that panel with your camera 47. Access granted. Where you're getting through that door 47. It only opens for people with an authentic security clearance. The signal is encrypted. Without a dongle, we can't hack it. Granted. I 
How are we doing? We are weapons hard. How are we looking? We clear. Clear and weapons hard. Image and Royce down. Take care of Hush and we can get to the core. You go flush him out. Darius! Ah. Protocol overruled. Those exercises been doing anything to the shoulder of yours. That bugging me a bit. It's accepting you may suffer partial or complete memory. Yeah. 
Sir, this place is Whoa, no, guy. He's dying street fight. Take that.
of the park. You need to...
shields, gentlemen. Protect the package at all costs. Okay, men. Let's get moving. Both targets down. I just need to override this, and I'm in. You can get out now, and I can take care of the data remotely. Unless you want to handle it yourself. to the data leak bombshell causing shockwaves across the world, the so-called ICA files. The disclosure of a... You win. So, what happens now? The ball's in your court, Miss Burnwood. I do have other candidates, you know, most of whom have never tied me to a chair. You've seen the news. That was 47 acting on his own. He is untethered, he is unstoppable, and he cannot be bargained with. He will find you, Mr. Edwards, and I'm the only chance you've got. I'm listening. 47 has one weakness. Me.